2016 Tesla Model X review. What is it? Tesla has already shaken up the luxury car market with the electric Model S, thanks to a combination of rapid performance, low running costs and respectable range. But as impressive as all that is, the saloon car seems to be a dying breed, due to the ever-increasing popularity of the SUV. The answer? Well, making an SUV seems like a sensible solution, something Tesla has done with the Model X. It was first seen as a concept back in 2013, but there have been a number of delays, due to issues relating to the unusual Falcon Wing rear doors and rear seat mounts, among other things. This car may have been originally penciled in for a 2014 release, but it still promises to offer cutting-edge technology. This includes autopilot, those automatic Falcon Wing doors and a range that can top 300 miles if you avoid the temptation that is the performance model. If temptation is too much, the P90D with the ludicrous speed upgrade can manage the 0 to 60 miles per hour sprint in a staggering 3.2 seconds that's McLaren F1 territory from a 2.5 ton, 7 seat SUV. Underneath the distinctive styling is the same skateboard style chassis that underpins the Model S. The battery pack lies flat on the floor beneath the seats, giving an incredibly low center of gravity, even with taller SUV bodywork. All Model X's are four-wheel drive, courtesy of a pair of electric motors, one powering the rear wheels and one for the front pair. In the P90D, these motors are rated at 503 bhp and 259 bhp respectively. Sadly, the electrical system can only provide a total combined output of 464 bhp, although this is increased to 532 bhp with the Lunacruz upgrade. What's it like? Getting inside the Model X can be quite a theatrical event. The front doors may be conventional but are electrically powered, with the driver's door opening automatically when you unlock the car with the key fob, 